Good morning, JD fam. Morning, okay. JD fam. Today is going to be our realistic morning routine. Say good morning, Miss Gaming. Good morning, little girl. He ain't not so loud in her ear. Oh, good morning. Say good morning. Um, so yeah, we just got her out of her bassinet and we unswaddled her. And normally in the morning, we'll just lay in bed with her for like five minutes and just let her stretch it out and cuddle her. And she's and, you know, the yeah, I think that's I think that's your sign to go change her. Oh, I just feel that. This guy, May. What did you do? Let it out, little girl. You put on daddy. Okay, Joshua May is gonna go change um, her now. Welcome to the morning routine. Every morning is different. So it really is. It's just we, our lives just depend on what you need. Basically, we're basically just your personal assistants. Yep. How do you feel? Being so, so popular. Let's start it off with a diaper change. <laughs> Alright, let's do it. Big yawn. Come on, Tap. Come oh, on, Tapper, come here. We love you too. Tapper, come, come here. here. We love you too. Careful. Okay. Come here. Come oh, here. Okay, we love you. Watch those paws, little guy. <laughs> Topper, okay, okay. Don't you guys worry. Topper is still getting all the love and attention that he needs, which is a lot. You need a lot, boy. To the peanut she goes. Okay, let's grab the diaper, some wipes, untie the swaddle. Actually, that's not even her swaddle, but we do swaddle her on top of this. While Josh takes care of the first child, or the second child, I take care of the first one. Topper, come on, let's go inside. Come on, let's go inside. Go potty, go potty. What's it looking like? <laughs> Just wanted she did some damage. <laughs> she did some damage. I'm proud of you, little girl. I, was, I didn't I need to get at it in you, little girl. <laughs> yes, I know what you're wondering. Did you really wake up looking like that? Yeah. <laughs> is, yes. Rough. Look at me. Rough. I don't know. I woke up like this. <laughs> I woke up like this. My little burrito. Look at that hair. You and daddy just both have a bad hair day this morning. Ah, can you get that camera? Oh, honestly, it's about time Katie B got thrown up, or spit up on. Okay, well, she always actually, spits up on me. hate to break it to you, but she missed. She just spit up on the floor. Okay, she does. She literally, I feel like she always I gotta, spit I up on I gotta my fix job. my face before we keep vlogging. Well, you look how cute you are. She's a little cute. All right, you guys, I'm getting ready. I'm doing my makeup, and I'm also gonna pump, and I'm using um, the Mom Cozy pump. These are the pumps that I use, because they're so nice, because they're portable, and you can be like hands-free. Um, and I don't pump all the time, because a lot of times I breastfeed, like I just fed her before we started filming this video, but I only fed her on one side, so I'm pumping the other side, so I can save the milk. Okay, so right now I'm pumping, so I gotta get out a bag so I can store my breast milk. What I do is I write the date on the bag, that way I know um, when the breast milk um, was pumped. And then um, I will put in the volume and then I'll put it in the freezer so that way I can save it for later If I ever have to leave or if we have a babysitter down the road and then eventually I'll probably pump so that way Joshy B can feed sometimes in the middle of the night But right now it's just me um, And I'm kind of choosing to do that. It? Can I not feed now? You want some protein? <laughs> oh god. You want some protein? The protein booby? The protein booby? A single mom who works two jobs, who loves her kids and never stops. Right, it's time to get this little girl dressed for the day. That's right. It's time to get in our little outfit. We're gonna let Katie B decide the outfit though because. Okay, yeah. Because, you know. I, yeah, because you put her in a three month old outfit yesterday. I did put her in a three month old outfit yesterday, but it was cute. It was a little tank top, you know? It was warm outside. Sometimes we just stare at each other and kind of make weird faces. What's up with you, Sky? Huh? Yeah, I know. All right, Sky, we got options. What's the vibe today? What's the vibe today? Oh, that one. <laughs> oh, okay. Mommy wants to match you. Okay, look. It's a newborn, but it's like an oversized one. So it's so cute because it's like huge on her, but it's supposed to be oversized. And I love it. So, Dang. oh, we're going to kind of match. <laughs> yeah, shocker. Hi, little, little transformation. How hard did you tie this? <laughs> I will say the hardest part, in my opinion, about having a newborn is changing them and putting them in different clothes. I don't know why, because I feel bad like trying to pull it over her head and stuff. So it takes me a long time. You, know, you don't always have to pull it over their head. Yeah, I know. Like this one is big enough to where you can pull it down like this. Like, okay, so her little arm's out. 
And then you take her booty, lift it up, and boom. Boom, she's free. She's free. Diaper change number two. I was gonna already. say, it's literally it's been 10. like 10 minutes, maybe. 10 minutes, so mommy's going in for the second diaper change. Diaper change, diaper change number two. You do go through a lot of diapers. That is one thing. I was like, there's just no way you have to change a baby that much. And you really do, which is not hard, but no, it's just it's like, crazy. when they tell you you have to change a lot of diapers, it, it, it's really very true. The thing is, is I really don't mind changing diapers. Like, to no. me, especially, it's the least time consuming thing. Like, breastfeeding takes like a lot longer than changing a diaper, so changing yeah. a diaper is super easy. Right on in it, you do the hokey pokey and you turn yourself around. That's what this guy's all about. Kay's a pro at changing the clothes. She, she's quick with it. You know? Me, it literally, like the other day, it took me like 15 minutes, but it's fine, you know? It's, it's fine. fine. Um, and then also, I do want to say, like, when I'm talking about changing the diapers and stuff, absolutely love it, and I'm not complaining. I'm just saying, I, I'm shocked at how many you do have to change. It is funny, because we did a TikTok where Josh like, a single mom, that works. How'd you like your outfit? <laughs> you look so, so pretty. Wait, should we get a bow? We just got a so whole bunch pretty. of bows. What kind of bow do you want? What kind of bow do you want? What kind of bow do you want? Oh look, do you want to match your brother with brown one? <laughs> I feel like we gotta go white. We got a lot of bows. I know. Sheesh. Oh, this is a white one. Oh, cute. But Josh doesn't like these kind, you said. Why? Oh, I like the, the tiny little headband. But I feel like it's better on her head right yeah, now. Yeah, it's Her easier. head is so fragile. Yeah. That, like, I don't want anything, like, extra. Top, are you helping out? What do we think? Do we love it? Do we love it? I think she loves it. Milk gone. Time to get the milk. Oh, you had those things in? I didn't even realize yeah. you had those things in. You didn't hear that noise? <laughs> no. I didn't get too much milk today. But whatever I do get, and normally a lot of times, like I feel like I'm a little bit of an oversupplier, but she just fed earlier. But I gotta get the milk out so that way your girl doesn't get engorged. And then I pour it into the bag. Boom. This little but girl got the hiccups right since now. Since I don't have too much, I'm gonna do my next feeding as well, and then I'll freeze it so that way it's like enough. Bad. So I got enough for my cinnamon toast crunch. Huh? What? Josh, that's disgusting. <laughs> I know. But look. The girl has been working hard over here to get a milk got supply. Got a milk up. supply going on. Which it's not huge, but we're working on it. You know, no. we're getting okay. there. It's, it's time, time for, for a walk. A Tell family me. walk. This How far you want to go on a walk? It's Topper's favorite part. I feel like it's her favorite part. I love family walks. You know, it's so pretty outside. The weather's good right now. You we know, just go on a quick walk. A lot of times we walk up to this really cute coffee shop. We get breakfast. But no, no. Josh, let's get to I'm home. ruining everything. Like I said, every day's different. Is with or without the newborn baby. Um, but I do have a haircut today, so I will have to do that. And then little girls going to the HQ. And we have such a big day planned. We have such a big day planned. And That's so a nap for you. Alright, let's get that. you in the car seat. This is your favorite part of the day, buddy. You ready to go on a walk? <gasps> yeah, you want to go on a walk? And boom. boom. Am I going to get a cry? No cry? No cry. Oh, oh. Oh, wait oh. for it. Wait. Yeah, no cry. No, no cry. Oh, no. Shocker. Mommy's got it. You know, she hasn't been much of a crier and I don't want to jinx it. Um, however, I will say yesterday we had a little bit of a day. I know, and someone, our like neighbor told us about this thing called the witching hour. And we were like, oh, what's a witching hour? And she's like, oh, you'll find out. And I don't know if that's what it was because it was the time. She said it's right around dinner time. Yeah, and that's what was... happened. So, But honestly, know. even before dinner time. Like the rat when we went yeah, to okay. get food in the car, like I had to let her hold my finger the whole time or she would freak out. But like, um, honestly, for yesterday the was just, part, everyone has bad days sometimes, even Sky. The thing is, but your mom thought she was like sick or something because she, she was fussing. I was like, no, I was like, it's, she like never fusses, she just like was upset. Yeah, she was having, having a day. A, having a day, but today's a good day. <laughs> Riders, keep your <laughs> hands inside the roller coaster at all times. This vehicle will go upside down, sideways, forward She's and like back. Holding on for dear life, let's go. Okay, we're going up the roller coaster. We're getting her ready for Cedar Point one day. Yeah, she's gonna be a little, little adrenaline junkie. All right, you guys, we are on our family walk, and 
This is honestly one of my favorite parts of the day. Hey, Katie B lot. got the pep in her step again, you know. Before you know? she was pregnant, she had that speed walk going down. Hey, I walked pretty fast. I walked pretty far for how pregnant yeah, I was. You walked far, but then we got the waddle going. Yeah, that's true. And then you had your little tear. Yeah, okay, That that's where Joshy B was like sprinting. And I was like, look, dude, I cannot. I was like, I can't keep up. I was like, my legs won't She's like getting her mojo go that back. Like I'm behind her. I'm trying to keep up now. I so. got my mom walk on. You know, I'm like sprinting. She's like. <laughs> also, we got baby Sky right here, and then we have this little thing. It's super like thin, and so it's like breathable through, so that way it can block out the sun. You know, but can't use it on a hot day because we don't want the heat to trap in there. Okay, Chopper, go see the fishies. Go see the fishies. Where are they? At? He's like, where are they? Where the are they? Go see the fishies. Oh, you love your walk. It's time for my favorite part of the day, which is the Joshy B special. Let's go, we're gonna get down to business. <laughs> Today we're making the Joshy B special, which is made with the CTC first form protein. We're gonna leave it linked down below. Yeah, now, a lot of times we'll do the CTC, and then sometimes we'll do pumpkin spice. Um, lots tis of the season one. for the PSL, <laughs> baby. Also, what I've been doing is making um, a pumpkin spice latte coffee some days too. So if I want my protein, if Joshy B isn't making me a Joshy B special, then I'll make it with a pumpkin spice latte protein with coffee. So fire. I love how we call it a Joshy B special, but. That's what you started calling it, so now it's just that. No, fire. that's what, when I when I used to make protein shakes for a living, um, that is though, what people call it. This Actually, protein powder that, literally so. tastes like Cinnamon Toast Crunch, so it's just fire. Have you made this on your own? Can you, can you oh, I did. Oh, easy, baby. No, Thank no. you. Like, literally, I made it like one day when he wasn't here, and it was so fire. And Josh should be, I mean, I don't want to tell you this. because No, like, you gotta admit, um, I put a little extra ounce of love you in You do put a little love don't in Don't lie. But then also, after we have our um, protein shake, we will take our micro factor packs, which is literally just a vitamin pack from First Form. They're fire because it's literally all your vitamins in one pack because we're kind of lazy and like, we gotta be efficient here. When you're a parent, you need to be efficient. Yo, and for real, uh, when we talk about First Form, it sounds like a lot, but really, your boy does take a lot of first form stuff, and so does Katie B. It's We're like actually going protein there. drink every single day. I do a multivitamin pack every single day. I take day. the greens every I day. I do the BCAs every single day. I 99% of the time do an energy drink, and then like 80% of the time 99. do a pre workout. So I'm not saying do what I do, but I take a lot. He has an energy drink every single no, day. No, it's not every single day. It's okay, often. Fine, especially with the newborn baby. It's often. But oh, yeah, you don't want to get it to your protein Ooh. milk. You don't want to. <laughs> <laughs> Um, all right, we do got some new ingredients. We just went and bought some more honey and cinnamon and stuff So I gotta take the lids off those. But all right, we're back. So anyways, it's um, we do oat milk cup of ice Two scoops of protein in this for two people honey. We do cinnamon powder on top of it mm -hmm. We do blueberries. I just made a mess. What else is new? Dump some blueberries in there and then candied walnuts and last but not least, the magical touch, hold on, let's get them on there, is the peanut butter. Let me tell you, one healthy scoop of peanut butter. So waiter! <laughs> Alright, I got my Joshi B special. Cheers, me. Cheers. Let's go. You know, it's good. I almost think I can make it better. Don't even. <laughs> Topper, Gustavino, Brooklyn. All right, now we plan the day. We plan our lives. Well, actually, a lot of times we'll plan the day or plan our day the like day before. The night before, yeah. I yeah, have some things before. on my list, but it's not 100% planned out. What What do you put on your stuff? Um, like what do I put on here? Like you just plan. Like for me, I write a to-do list, and then I do uh, three things I'm thankful for, how I'm gonna make today great, and Ooh. then I end with three affirmations. I normally start the day with a um, devotional, so that's like my like, mm -hmm. how's the day go, you know, okay. like a devotional. And then my, honestly my calendar is a little bit more of a to-do list, and then with like things that like we already have scheduled, so yeah. I like that, little calendar. Like today I have um, a couple brand deals I need to film. She wanted to be a part of it. She does love writing goals with her daddy. Like I have oh. upload the nursery TikTok because I made a TikTok to go with the YouTube video that we made for it to oh. show TikTok a little sneak peek. And then my dad and my sister fly in tonight so we gotta get them from the airport. And then I got a few other things I had to do for JD Fit. Um, but yeah. What about you? What you got today? I got a lot of stuff today. Yeah. But first, mm. three things I'm thankful for oh, are let's hear. 
our family walks. Yes. Um, getting to sleep well, got to sleep well last night. And last but not least, Katie be a good wife and a good mother. What about your daughter? I switch it up, like when you write yeah, three no, I, every I single day, it. honestly those are like the most basic ones, like you gotta get creative. Yeah, that's true. So like, you know, but I am super you write three things, every, I've been writing three things every day for, for a long time. So. For me, I'm grateful for a healthy baby and an amazing support system between my husband and family and friends and just people who are always there okay. and mostly just like you being an amazing support system with a sky and I'm also super grateful for where we live. I love it here. It's, it just mm. makes me happy. Like the weather is so nice. I love it. Mm. It is that every day I wake up happy. I like that. I agree with that one. All right. Let's get to it. What are you guys grateful for? Comment down below. This is my favorite part about this stage right now is the snuggles. And I'm trying to soak all of this in because I know it's a matter of time before She's not gonna be this little, not gonna be this snuggly, but honestly, that's why I was gonna say my nighttime or our nighttime routine is my favorite because of all the cuddles and she literally, literally just like sleeps on my chest, but we get it in a little bit in the morning too, but mornings are a little more busy, um, a little more chaotic, but she's sleeping right now. And she looks so cute. I also love what we do because um, it's so helpful to capture all the moments, all the little memories. And it's really cute because literally yesterday we were looking back at a whole bunch of like fan edits and it was like videos like I totally forgot about our relationship and just like cute little things we said and we're like one day there'll be a little us running around. And then like cut like, the clip of us in the clip sky of... and I was like oh that's so cute but. You're not running yet but soon. Yeah definitely not yet but. Um, yeah, we got so good in all these moments and, and capture it. So because you go way, away so fast, she's already getting so guys much older. And it's so sad. We get to look back on all these memories. I so <laughs> she's so precious right now when she sleeps. Got done doing a little work. Um, we're shooting a ad for another company. So baby girl. So we basically just had to show our lives as newborn parents, and this is it. You did it. Oh, her passion oh, are you fell, that's why. I, know. I, think I think she's, she's hungry. hungry. She's, she's trying to eat my bicep right now. Okay, mommy's gonna feed you. Time to feed her. Welcome to Starbucks. We are gonna make our special, um, we're gonna make a little coffee. It's an iced Americano, um, super simple. I'm gonna show you guys how it's done and then we're gonna head to the HQ. All right, we got that espresso shot coming now. This is step number one. Okay, I think. Iced Americano, we got oat milk, cinnamon powder, a pump of mocha, and espresso and water. Let's go. We're headed to the JD HQ. We might go on TikTok live, you know, baby girl, she's in the back sleeping, doing her thing. Hello. <laughs> um, yeah, we're out here. I'm traveling with the, the package in the back. The we got the package is secured. is secured. And I swear, it's like, it's she's so quiet back there. Like, sometimes I'll be driving, I'll be like, oh my gosh, the sky's back there. Yeah, and yesterday but, was her first, like, fussy day in the car and I'm like, all right girl, um, it's fine, but today she's been good. She's been really good, she's been good. We're at the JDHQ, here, we got Molly, we got Mike. <laughs> we out here, um, we're gonna do a meeting with our ads manager real quick and then we also got something cool to show you in the office Ooh. that we've been working on. We just we got this a little space. renovation. We're renovating it, um, it's been a couple days, so we're gonna show you real quick. All right, let's go show you. Okay, so we just had this wall made and then we're gonna have it go all the way down and then we have like a couch, it's gonna be like, it's gonna be basically like a little studio setup, um, but oh, yeah. I think it looks really, really cool. We're gonna put like a big olive tree there, a like boucle chair, um, you know, do some stuff for like move, JD Fit. You guys see the before the and after. Before, it so. definitely looks a lot different. So yeah. It's looking good. Someone's got a little double chin. Oh, good morning. <laughs> It went really good. We're really excited because we have so much to come for Black Friday, all the new collections in October, November, December. I'm like so impatient because I already know all the collections and I want to start wearing them because they're so freaking cute. Um, but I can't because I can't spoil them yet. Um, but I'm just super excited. All the deals are gonna happen, everything. We got a lot coming. And with the new room, I have a lot of filming to do, which I'm very excited for. All right, y'all, me and baby Sky over here cranking some numbers. We're getting things dialed in, but 
we are gonna be launching a new collection next Wednesday, which is, it'll be October 4th. KB is gonna give you guys a sneak peek. And we're also launching with it a exclusive, um, very limited shirt to go with it. That okay. says in my basic era. It's gonna be like a graphic tee. It's gonna be super cool. So the collection name is, go ahead Joshua, take it away. Pretty Basic. So the reason we decided to do Pretty Basic is because it is like a basic oversized tee and then a really cute spandex. And the reason we decided to call it this is because it's, I feel like what every like basic girl or mom like wears, like I mean I literally wear a t-shirt and like normally like spandex like every For me, day. I also kind of like the plan words like it's you're pretty basic and it's pretty and basic. Exactly. So I, I thought know. it was kind of fun to Let's call see it that. The, um, the so logo. basically this is the t-shirt. This is called the boyfriend tee. This is size tea, large though, but I wear size medium so they're like you know, it is unisex too. Newest the logo is sick. Logo. It's literally like a silicone, like lasered cutout, which I love. And then this is what it looks like. The like exclusive one will be white, and then on the back, it's gonna say, say "In my basic era." Yeah. Era, yeah. era. Since Josh B is a Swifty now, you know we're playing Swifty on now. that. But anyway, this is what the boyfriend tee looks like, and then we have the curved and then, spandex. But wait, there's more. Which you guys have been asking for like a little bit longer of an option for spandex, so. You know, we listen, and we got you in this color. Seamless spandex coming out. Oh yeah. This is what they look like. So this is the logo. Mm -hmm. It's focusing on Josh's nope, face. Nope, nope. Ooh. And then these are the pink ones. And then they're super, super comfy. They're seamless. And then they also have like this little like curve on like where the butt goes to like accentuate the booty. So basically these are longer, so they're perfect to go with um, the t-shirt. basic. So you can see like the spandex under the t-shirt. And then we're gonna oversize t-shirt and be basic. It's a vibe, um, <laughs> and yeah, and if you guys want one of those limited edition shirts, make sure you shop You better them. be quick um, at the drop. We'll probably do a couple different drops of them depending on if you guys are interested and like them because we've never done anything like that before, so it's the first time. Um, we're thinking if this does well to do like a graphic tee with the collection, like yeah. based off the collection, every collection we do, so we'll Just see. Just something fun. Moving forward, Not something different, option. something fun, add a little spice. A little bit nice. A little nice, but make sure you guys are at the drop. <laughs> um, Sky May, how are we feeling at the office? How are you working on the job, girl? You better get fired. With that being said, we're gonna get back to work, and that kind of ends our morning routine. So. Oh yeah, you you know, as a parent, I feel like it definitely switches up every single day. So it's not really like always different, always the same. But I will say the word routine always, probably isn't like the right word. But. but it's a day in our life of the morning. We'll say that. <laughs> Dang, I feel like we've completed every morning routine possible. Like. Dating, morning routine, engaged, married. That is true. Um, now like a family. Living together like, and now morning routine with the baby, so. But then I guess we'll have to do a morning routine with two babies. Oh my gosh, no, <laughs> it never ends. <laughs> it never ends. Peace guys, stay savage, don't be average.